Thank you, Dr. Cohen, and for your leadership. As you can see, these numbers are too high. Considering our trends and cooler weather driving events indoors, North Carolina will remain paused in our current phase three, and we will adjust our indoor gathering limit down from 25 to 10 people. The science shows that the transmission of this virus is much greater indoors. And the more people who are gathered, the easier this virus can spread. We saw increasing spread from social gatherings in October. This reduction in our indoor gathering limit aims to slow the spread and bring down our numbers. It also sends a serious signal to families, friends, and neighbors across our state. Success in slowing the spread will help our businesses. In addition, we've been providing some direct help, and this week there will be some additional assistance for restaurants. Starting Thursday, full-service restaurants seeking help with rent payments or mortgage interest may apply to the North Carolina Department of Commerce for up to $20,000. As Dr. Cohen talked about, Thanksgiving is just two weeks away, and many North Carolinians are focused on how to celebrate the holiday amid the pandemic. There will be the usual concerns about who's carving the turkey and whether you're going to talk about politics. But we need everyone focused on how to keep safe this holiday season. And I want North Carolinians to keep something else in mind as plans come together. This pandemic will end. A vaccine is in the final stages of development, and the FDA has authorized a promising new treatment. Hope is on the horizon. This pandemic will not last forever.